is uh, really, really like skill based. I, I think it's generally, I think it's relatively even. Um, both of these characters. Oh, and the Dragon Quest music. Nice. Let's go. Um, here on Battlefield, I think that your triplads are probably going to be really good for Palos. Going to try to get some of those uh, long combos to take you up into the air and maybe launch you off the top. Good up air coverage as well. I mean, still, Young Link can do the exact same thing. Hopefully trying to use some of these projectiles to lead into these good hits. That's why uh, Young Link is considered the best of the three Link brother, or I guess uh, relatives. Sure, we'll go with relatives. Um, being able to connect some of these projectiles into these uh, these nice, strong sword hits. Even though you don't have like the range of, say, adult Link sometimes, uh, it doesn't really matter at the end of the day because you have, I think, stronger combo game. All right, but now Palutena keeping this you know, still somewhat in, in their favor until then, right? Like Donk looking for an edge guard here, not able to get anything. The back air is invincible. Can use that as a, as a trump card for some of these unruly get up options. Um, however, Zexy has been pretty good so far at staying alive. Okay, I like it. The big call out with the down air, nice. Still trying to get some of these bomb setups, but uh, I like it, you know, Donk using the teleport to get around some of that stuff, using platforms as well. Not getting an option. Again, these teleports just allowing Donk to kind of retake center stage very quickly. Uh, Zexy needs to figure out how to deal with that because right now it's a get out of jail free card for Donk, but now it's going to be used there. The forward air going to catch the jump. Uh, very nice stuff, Zexy. Staying on their first stock as well. This could be some good extra credit. And again, that the combo game uh, looking pretty good. Oh, the footstool. Wow. Went really deep for the footstool too, but absolutely calculated. Very, very nice stuff. A quick end to the second stock. And now we are beginning the third. Very clean. All right, now just trying to cover yourself to get back to the stage. And I like that. The lead into the upbeat. You don't always see that. That was a bit of a risky uh, call out, but it does force the air out of Donk. And now that's a three stock technically. So uh, is actually going to be very happy with that. Those those last stocks went by in a rush. Um, so we're going to go. I don't know if they're going to run it back, but we'll see. Um, it feels like there wasn't a lot of stage, stage picking. Uh, thought process, I would say, going into that one, so we'll see. We'll see. They might be running it back to Battlefield. Okay. Yep, same characters. We're going to stick with it. And, okay, just small Battlefields. Okay. Okay, the Fatal Fury music. Okay, you know what? We, we are already hitting some straight bangers right now. Okay, trying to get some of these... Uh, Nice parries on these projectiles is going to be important to continue continue this uh, this run back. Obviously, Dunk not not worried. Although maybe maybe could be. Okay, I like it. Coverage with the down tilt again that can lead into the back air, but good di uh, out for Zexy to get out of that situation. This is looking a lot better for Dunk. Okay, now the edge guard begins once again. Uh, still, that's a really, really good read. Catching uh, a, a few of those backers is now starting to turn the tides here. Uh, Zexy, after taking a very convincing first game, now uh, a little bit at disadvantage here. Oh, I like it, the run up grab, but can't get really anything out of it. Uh, the very good, I mean, the quick mash kind of doesn't really anything doesn't get any pummels either which i thought was kind of interesting now looking for the eye oh, okay we land on platform almost had the reset there but uh, not able to get anything retreats back to ledge again donk not a kill percent still needs a little bit more work done in the part of sexy Okay, missing out on one more opportunity. Zexy just whiffing a little bit more. These back airs going <laughs> going crazy right now, but the fizzle of the uh, the explosive flame fortunately doesn't come, uh, nothing comes out. Trying to get around these projectiles and doing a pretty good job of it right now. Donk staying alive. And again, full stock lead now, so 
We are looking pretty good. However, these arrows that can lead, as we mentioned, uh, into good hits. Okay, I don't know. Getting clipped with the upper, kind of unfortunate there. Again, Sexy still looking for something here. Needs to take the first stock in order to bring this momentum back. However, I mean, still staying alive again. Youngling can be kind of forced into some of these, uh, these situations. You get pigeonholed into basically a few clutch options, and then all of a sudden uh, they're readable. And right now they are readable. Donk able to maintain the stock lead. Oh, okay. A really interesting call out, but then can't really convert off of it. Back there, not going to do it center stage. Okay, wow. So the, the ledge cancel, but actually gets a little bit punished for it. Um, I like the idea, but Sexy just kind of put their head down and just went right for it and honestly didn't really care the consequences and takes the stock, but uh, that's, you know, fires right back. Again, these back airs uh, right now. That, that invincibility can barrel through anything that Sexy wants to go for, which is one of the most important factors of that move. Okay, good punish on that one. Again, dash attack, same, same deal. Has the invincibility on the shield. Okay, a B into up air, a good ground to confirm. And lead into bigger hits like this, nice juggles in the lead into the bombs as well. Okay, okay. Very, very nice stuff. So Zexy is absolutely not out of this yet. Brings it to final stock. Uh, and again, at low percent as well. So this is looking much more even than it was before. Uh, I, I think that Zexy is just catching a couple more of these good confirms, and that's what you need is Youngly. That's the win con. So uh, Donk looking like they need to seal something in terms of damage. Okay, wow, that, the lead in the boomerang actually confirms the up B as well. Almost gets it off the forward air, uh, trying to mix the DI just a little bit. Can't catch this. The fadeaway explosive flame, but unfortunately... Wow, actually manages to use the uh, the teleport again, as we saw in uh, in the first game. Uh, using that, that teleport to kind of retake center stage yet again. Still putting himself in a little bit of uh, unsafe situations, and that's going to do it. One... One grab could be uh, the setup to this edge guard. However, again, good aggressive up Bs so far have not been punished by Zexy. Oh, but that will very, very nice catch into the up smash. That was a little close, but okay. The the, the, the big bro, dat me up, GGs, all that good stuff. Very interesting. I mean, I was I was kind of surprised because that was looking like it was it was Donk's game. Right at the very beginning, you could tell it was complete reversal from how it was in game one. The complete, like the three stock uh, with the footstool and everything. Um, that was kind of interesting to see because it shows that, I mean, Sexy just kind of had the consistency, had the patience. Um, again, you know, Young Link has the projectiles, has the range pressure to be able to handle, handle the situation like that, where you just kind of have to plant your feet and play as patiently as possible be a little campy, and then all of a sudden that could turn the tides and make that game that you thought was not yours uh, somewhat closer to.